Good morning. So, right now we got to, uh, <laughs> look how I got to keep the latch pulled up because this doesn't pop open. But, I got to get my jerry can out of here. Ooh. Oh, jeez. Fill this up with gas. Because we're going drifting tomorrow. My helmet. And then. These gotta go in the rear. I'll burn those off first thing tomorrow. Gotta put tires on those. Yes, yeah, so we're on our way to Home Act hardware store. We get those bolts. If these mirrors would turn. There we go. And then uh hitting up the gas station. Go uh go get some gas, obviously, like I said. You're right, that's what I said. So I decided to work on this uh, for now just to get this done out of the way because I don't got to do much on this um, but this is the part that I had June weld up for me as you can see it clocks it way over so it's gonna sit like that kind of away from there but I meant to grab a little sheet of metal to uh, make a little heat shield that will bolt onto these or somewhere and just straight over and down and just so I don't have to worry about it or think about it anymore because I don't want to worry about it or think about it anymore because this I'll be leaving this at the track tomorrow and then um, I'll be driving back with somebody or I'll have somebody um, come with me or take me back yeah whatever the deal is um, yeah, so this won't be taking up space here no more. And, uh, oh, look at this thing. What is that? You a grasshopper? Hmm. Yeah, and then, uh, so I gotta run back to the hardware store and get, uh, who that looks even better in the daylight, doesn't it? Looks nice. But, uh, and then uh, once once I once I get this taken care of and done out of the way, um, I'll get cracking on this. Just so I can do this while uh, I have some daylight, so I'm not uh, working out here in the bugs and stuff. Oh, look who it is! It's Benjamin. You decided to wake up and come outside today, huh? <laughs> look at you! Look all orange. And there we go. Suit of aluminum, ten bucks. I feel like that's expensive, but no, I really don't know. Not too bad. It's probably gonna flop around a little bit, but it's better than burning up couplers. Now I just need a coupler, and I think I may have to run to Up Garage just, just and cross my fingers that they have one, because I thought I had one, bro. I I could have swore that I had a uh, another uh, 45 or not a 45. Um, a 90 that I could make work, but I don't. The only ones I have are straight couplers that are only like this big, and they're all three inch. The only two and a half inch one is the one that has a hole in it, and I can't cut it any certain way with any of the pipes I have to get it to fit, so. Worst case scenario, I would drive it like this to the track with just some janky setup, and then, hello. <laughs> and then I'll find a coupler there. Well, I think I found out why I kept shredding belts. Look at that. I don't know if you can see it on video, but this has hella lateral movement. I just loosened it up to put a belt on, but it's probably why, dude. It probably got cockeyed. And then. Like that, like see how the pulleys lined up? Probably did that or this, some during like a uh, <laughs> under like full throttle, and then probably just tore up the belt. So glad I found that. Probably would have been tearing up all these ones, man. Hey, there's Paul. 
That's not Paul. We are here. Damn. Is it for Subarus? It's funny when I first got the uh, the Odyssey, I ordered these, and these these are already here. Like I ordered some of these same ones on the uh, auctions, but these were already here. Like two days after I ordered them, I came here and I saw these sitting here, and they were twenty percent off. Would have saved like fifty bucks. This is what I was looking for, and damn, they don't have it. And part of me, something in my mind was kind of remembering they had a 45, but they don't. That's exactly what I need. Shoot. Good morning. So, I didn't get to finish the 180 last night. Um, after I got back from Up Garage in Hachinohe, I picked up uh, KFC and we ate dinner and that just did not sit well with my stomach. I felt so sick. I thought I was going to throw up, so I don't think I'm going to be eating that again. I might be able to cut this one up. We'll see. That actually might be what I do because I think that's all two and a half inch. Let's see. 180 is all good to go. Load it up. I think I'm gonna drive this and I'll have Kane drive the van. We'll see how long it runs. Here he is. <laughs> we're about to head out. Let me turn this up. <sighs> yeah, I'll work on you later.
make one. But you see, this was my initial attempt at trying to get it, but I had to get it. See how it's welded? Oh, it's hot. See how this is welded? I had to. Ha I had it cut and welded out of diagonal. Because before it was straight up and the coupler was almost, it was like that far away from that pipe. And so I tried to make this. I made this this morning. Oh, okay. And uh, Is it just out of the Yeah. Uh, I just went and got some aluminum from Pomac and tried to get something, but it's... Uh, See, that's where my job comes in. Is it, like, there's a shit ton of, like, scrap metal, like, steel. And yeah. Fucking... smoking dude if, I hope I'm not spitting oil because this looks okay it's just getting hot as shit hmm. Come, it's like this. The funny thing is, it's probably like 83. 85. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. So, like the normal August is yeah. know, mid to upper 90s. <laughs> Dang, it looks like my car. I just did a double take. I was like, hey, it looks like my car. And I was like, oh, yeah. Fucking hot, dude. Yeah, I know, man. I'm getting red. Yeah. I didn't really That's all good. Look this is up. pretty much how it sat on my car too. <laughs> oh yes, thank you. I'm trying to clean it up a bit. Oh, it's all good. I'll do. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna do clear lenses and stuff anyways. Oh yeah. Yeah. I'll give you this anyways. You want this? Sure. It's when you were, you wanted it before and I'm like, I never got this though. <laughs> Where's my new front end? So. Uh, that's that's it for the track day. The 180, um, it was. Uh, I need a catch can on it because I'm, I'm getting a lot of blow by and it's it's uh, shooting oil into the turbo and it's it's leaking underneath. And uh, I thought it was the coupler that was uh, heating up and catching, but it's actually the the oil from all the blow by inside my turbo. So I got to get a catch can or something because I. Uh, that probably would have caught on fire had I not noticed the smoke and the lack of power. I think I thought I had lack of power. It seemed really slow, but maybe that was just because the exhaust almost fell off too. I got to get bolts for the exhaust and another. Uh, and I need an alignment, or not an alignment. I need uh, control arms for the rear so I can uh, get that camber, get my camber nice and flat. Because uh, I'm running, I'm, I'm only using about like half the tire, you know. So. I gotta do something about that, and then uh, I gotta get my front aligned. 
don't know if I'm gonna. I gotta break free those bolts, but they're uh, they're wanting to strip out because they're on the top hat, the top hat bolts to get the camber on the front. But they're wanting to strip out, so I might just need to take them off and uh, I don't know, do something about it. But yeah, another another shakedown for the 180. It's getting there, slowly getting there, but we're on our way home. I'm starving. I need to get food. I've only had like a little Lawson sandwich, but a lot of pictures and a few videos. Um, I'll try and throw them in with the vlog today, but yeah, we're going home. I definitely need to eat something. I might actually hit that Lawson's right there. Actually, I'm going to. Starving. Starving Marvin. Gotta go back to work tomorrow. Man.